It is such an honor to be gathered together tonight in hope, in memory, but in promise of a future. I especially want to acknowledge the Sodi family and the amazing witness and faithfulness that you have brought to this memorial. It gives me life. It gives us life. Thank you. I come as a Catholic sister. And as a Catholic sister in our faith tradition, we honor saints, people who have been notable for their amazing gifts of generosity or love or responding to the needs around. In reflecting on Valerie's amazing story and seeing the man, I have come to realize that in my perspective, Balbiter Sodi was, is a saint, is a holy man, is a person to be reverenced. His generosity in caring for neighbors is amazing. His willingness to do the foolish thing of give himself to care for others, that is something to be emulated and to hear that he was planting flowers in what had to be a hot Arizona sun. That is perseverance for beauty. It's that gift, that willingness to let the beauty outside reflect his beauty that was on the inside that moves me to say, in our tradition, we would call him saint. But saints are not just to be marveled at. Sometimes we want to put them on a pedestal and just pretend like, oh, it couldn't be us. That's, that was amazing. We couldn't do that. Saints rather, in our tradition, are to be emulated. Pope Francis has recently made this very clear when he calls on everyone in the world to embody and witness the spirit of love and welcome and inclusion for all. That is the job that is given to us. And it's the saints that can encourage us to know it's possible. In our nation over the last 20 years, it seems we've been driven further apart. For the last 17 years, I've lived in Washington, D.C. and done politics, and it has gotten more and more difficult. But tonight, what I feel renewed is that commitment to finding a way forward together. Faith is the witness that calls us to be in relationship, in community, and the power of the sick faith for me is to see the community that gathers together. I was so touched to see you gathered in prayer here, and I felt my heart at one, wanting to belong. That's the witness that you bring to us. Breaking out of division into the hunger for oneness so that we might indeed be reconciled to each other in our nation, that we may respond to the needs around us. So my faith calls us, and I invite you to join me as we are challenged to renew our own lives, to recommit to the journey in the footsteps of St. Balbir Sodi. Let us plant flowers. Let us act for justice. Let us work for the healing of our community. And let this be the lasting tribute so that, as we've said 20 years from now, we might be closer together. We might recognize each other as brothers and sisters, and we will say, yes. St. Balbir Sodi started this but we're carrying it on. Thank you.